hey guys good morning welcome back to my channel happy saturday i just woke up well everybody just woke up it is 11 56 so i am about to make us some food probably do like a little brunch i'm gonna make some fried chicken some waffles and we're gonna have some fruit with that and i'm gonna make jimmy some eggs so yeah that's what i'm about to do um yeah y'all see my pretty flowers they're so beautiful look how pretty these roses are they're so pretty and i should have put them in some water but i'm gonna do that a little later so yeah let's just get started on brunch so right now as y'all can see i already started cleaning my chicken i'm about to just put some vinegar in it let that soak for like five to seven minutes and pour some vinegar in it chicken is clean i'm just gonna pour some oil in the pan that should be good all right y'all so the chicken is all clean y'all see the water the water is so clear that's how i always know when my chicken is clean that's why you need to be making sure make sure y'all clean your chicken with vinegar sometimes i use lemon or like a lime and let me tell you it will clean your chicken i use Lowry's adobo garlic powder garlic salt and onion powder and sesame and this is how the chicken will come from so this is how your chicken should be looking if it's really seasoned. I make the best fried chicken, right then? Yeah. I make it better than daddy. Cause he always be like, oh, you make the chicken. The chicken is seasoned, now we got to put it in the flour. started washing my fruit I just poured some baking soda in it just a tad bit because I don't want my berries to get sore we're gonna just rinse them off right now you don't want a strawberry yes. the chicken's almost done mommy you get it when we're done here yeah, take a strawberry bite yummy yummy you like a strawberry yeah. Melly you want strawberry I popped the waffles and the toaster, and they should be done in a minute. The chicken is finished, and Demi's making the eggs now. This is how the chicken came out. It's looking too good. You stole a grape? <laughs> the eggs is coming out good. Okay. I made the girls' plates. Yeah, this is how their plates is looking. I'm about to serve them. And this is Demi's plate. Here you go, Sam. You're welcome. The girls are eating their food. They tearing it up. They ain't really eat the waffles yet, but they eating the chicken. Mella, we eat chicken. Mella ate her chicken already. You want another chicken? You gonna eat your fruit first? Yeah. Is it good, Melly? Yeah. Yeah. Food is done. I already started eating. The girls is eating. I'm only eating my waffles with chocolate chips from now on. Ever since Demi made it for me on Mother's Day like that, it's too good. I'm trying to figure out what we gonna do today because it's nice outside. I might take the girls to the park. So Demi wants to wait until tomorrow to go to the fair, so we can do that. So we're gonna just chill in the house today. Yeah, this chicken is so good. <laughs> when I tell y'all, I put my foot. Do you hear that crunch? I was just about to say they heard the crunch. Amazing. Okay, it's the mark. You ready your food right? Oh, I thought I had to finish my chicken. Mm. Demi's in my room. She's eating. I told her she didn't have to eat on the floor, but she felt like she don't spill something in my bed, so she just sit on the floor. She's eating. She's watching Dance Moms, and she's eating her food. And she likes to watch TV and eat. But yeah, let me finish eating, and I'm going to talk to y'all in a few. Hey, guys. So it is a little bit later, and y'all see what we doing. The twins are sleeping. Demi trying to fake sleep. She was just on the phone. Girl, you was not sleeping. It was a fake sleep. Yeah, so we just chilling. That food literally put us down. I really want to take a nap while they napping. So I think that's what I'm going to do. We probably not going to go nowhere. Demi don't want to go nowhere. She want to chill. This is what she likes to do. Sit in the bed and relax. Okay. This makes me so happy. Like, spending time with my daughters. I love them so much. And I literally could cry out because y'all really don't understand. Like, I love them so much. Everybody in my body. It makes me so emotional. This is what it feels like to be a mom no but i really love being a mom and i really love my daughter so much mom why are you on your own for you because i'm lit me and Demi and the twins did an ad with pampers liddy pampers and sam's club so she said i'm on my own for you page we did that look at us then why do you have a tear coming out your eye because i don't know i'm so emotional you know how i get 
So yeah, we're gonna just nap for a little while. Demi's still watching her dance moms. Nelly is knocked out. Look at her. So knocked out too. Them girls tired. But yeah, we're gonna take a nap, so we'll see y'all in a little while. I got my cookie with me and my mom for the first time. <laughs> Here is a lady. <laughs> Let's go. That's what you want? Get it. Large desserts. Let's get the six pack. The cookies. Pick all of them. Thank you. She couldn't wait for us to get home. Give me one. Stop playing with me. So I'm trying one of the cookie dough bites. Cause she was too thirsty to wait till we get home. Go ahead. She said I'm cringy. That's cringy. Demi, we home. Back home and we about to try crumble cookie for the first time. And I'm so excited. These are the cookies for the week. These look too good. I'm gonna let Demi go first. I'm gonna try that one. Chocolate chip. <laughs> I rate this like a 5 out of 10. Yeah, I give it like a 4.5. Next, I'm gonna try the peach cobbler. It's too sweet for me. I give it a 5.5 out of 10. You have to bite it like you mean it. <laughs> I, she never want to eat nothing. Like she don't eat leftovers. All she want to eat is what she want to eat. And I know what she want to eat. Bye, damn, yo! <laughs> One, two, three, bite. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, you're not being fair. I swallow mine too. I taste you. <laughs> and she turned in that rap. We doing a review. You gotta give them your honest review. I have an honest review. <laughs> <laughs> the skillet cookie. You like it? I would say it's like <gasps> <laughs> okay. Yeah, I rate that like an eight out of ten. I like that one. I give it an eight and a half. Cookies and cream crispy bar. Oh, you're gonna take a little bite actually. There you go. No, I don't like how it feels. You made me eat that, so it's fair. That was not a bite. Mom, I'm not playing. I will, I will. What? Take a bite. One out of ten. Take your bite. A big bite. What you rate it? You gotta swallow it. Zero. What are you doing, any mini money, Mo? I knew it was gonna be that one. Okay, boyfriend, y'all. I don't got a three out of ten. Too sweet for me. I'm a sell. So this is the last cookie. It's the sugar cookie. I think this one's gonna be the best one. Yeah, you eight out of ten again. Mm. <laughs> Bruh, if it's nasty, then why are you handling it? Yeah, I think that's your vibe. You're like that. Because it's like party cake. Right. <laughs> what? What you give it? It's a 1.1. That's a 1.1? I rate mine to four. Four out of ten. <laughs> nah, I'm not. This is our last one. Right? We're done. Wait, no, it's not bad one. It's good. 6.6. That's our caramel cookie review for the week. We had so much fun doing it. Maybe we'll try next week. Maybe we won't. I had fun. We tasting. Have, we had fun tasting it. Love you guys. Bye. <laughs>
I could never. Let me stop for this part. <laughs> but this is their second time going on it. So my whole thing is like, if it was so bad the first time, why are you going back on it again? And Hawaiian, like crying. She was crying to your sister now when she got off. Ah, uh, Demi is on this pond. Uh, this is so crazy. Oh my god. They're gonna be so dizzy. Uh, Demi looks like she about to throw up. And oh my god, I'm literally crying. He's on the orbiter right now, and y'all just didn't go up and it spins so quick. Like next, Demi and Diva getting on the flying. So yeah, my girl's at the fair living her best life. She's so happy. And then you know what she said to me earlier? She was like, oh my god, I love my life. And yeah, my heart literally smiled. I was so happy she said that. You ready? You excited? Yeah. Oh, this ride is literally going so fast. Then the little buggy thing that they in is swimming and swirling too. Y'all hear them screaming? Look at this one. Yeah, so this is the last ride that I think I'm going to be following them too. Because I want to try some food. Like, I'm hungry. And I don't want to be at the carnival and don't try the food. So, yeah. We're about to try as much food as we can. because I really want to try the deep fried Oreos. He's talking about cash only and all I have is my car. So I'm about to just go to this ATM real quick so I could take $10 off because I really want to try these Oreos. So we will not be trying deep fried Oreos because the ATM, the one and only ATM that they have out here is off. So I'm so pissed off right now, I'm so mad. I should have brought some cash. All right, y'all, so I'm about to try the blooming onion and try the fried pickles. Never tried fried pickles before. But I don't really like pickles, so. I don't know. Try to Still too mad. I cannot try the deep fried Oreos. Like I never had deep fried Oreos. I'm gonna try them one time. I'm gonna make them. Hey guys. So I'm at the blooming onion and I'm trying the fried pickles. It's my first time trying fried pickles. They have this special sauce. So I'm gonna dip it in. He just took it out the oil, so it's really hot. I give this a six out of ten. I really don't like pickles. Demi love pickles, so I actually gotta try to find her see she at. But yeah, this is a solid six out of ten. This was fifteen dollars. I already took a bite of this, but this is a frozen chocolate cheesecake, and then I got a bunch of goodies. Then I got frozen chocolate covered strawberries, one more, and then I got a frozen chocolate banana with sprinkles. So I tried all of them, but I'm gonna try them again for y'all and read it because so yeah this is the frozen cheesecake this is a solid eight out of ten it was good i never had chocolate frozen cheesecake the chocolate covered frozen them. three out of ten i don't really like that i'm never gonna try the chocolate covered strawberries five out of ten i'm not really feeling it the cheesecake is the best one. I love the cheesecake. Demi and Diva just got off the ride. They're right here getting mozzarella sticks, so I think chicken tenders. I told her I wanted her to try the fried pickles, so we'll see. Yeah, they just tried the fried pickles and they both spit it out. They didn't even get to chew it. They just bit it and was like I over it. I, I took a, a chew. I can't do that. The girl said they had fun, so I'm happy. But we on our way to the car. When they say she get it from her mama, I'ma say you fuck her right body back home from getting demi's hair done and i am packing right now I'm on a little trip because the twins birthday is monday but we're going tomorrow just packing everybody's stuff right now it's really late it's like almost two in the morning it's 1 51 so that's what i'm doing right now all of this stuff is demi's Stuff is the twins, and then this is mine. 
and I have these so like little basic sets from Body by Raven that I got. Like this is so freaking cute. Like her packaging is dope. But I got a purple set and I got a red set. And then I got my skims. And this is my bag. And then this is Demi's bag. And I know y'all gonna ask me, but I got both bags from Dolls Kill. I think they both were like $50 or $75 a piece. I don't know. I'm not sure. Oh, let me move my pajamas. These are my pajamas. Over here. So freaking cute. These are like the Jordan 4s. These are so cute. So she said she want to bring those. But yeah, I'm so excited for you guys to see where we're going. We're going to have so much fun. The girls are going to have so much fun. But yeah, let me just get to packing and I'll talk to y'all when I'm done. twins car seats out my car now i'm about to transfer them into the rental joy that you are staying with us please text us immediately should you need anything during your stay and we have our own personal concierge we all settled in and i just laid me and the girls <laughs> me and the girls pajamas out the twins are wearing cute lilo and stitch pajama demi's wearing her lilo and stitch i try to do like a little triplet thing with them and then I just have my pink pajamas right here. To some ice book, you'll be heavy in my mind. Can you get the heck out? Alright, so I'm all done putting on my trend on when that's the first step that I do when I get out the shower after I finish washing my face. I put this on. I was prescribed this by the dermatologist and I feel like it's really been working. Um, fade your dark marks and it minimizes your pores. Yeah, I've been uh, loving this. And the next thing I do is I put on baby uracine. I feel like that's the best thing that's been helping my skin too with the La Roche Posay. This is it. It's the uracine baby eczema relief cream. This moisturizes my skin so good. It leaves your skin with like a glow, like a shine. You don't need a lot. I don't use a lot. Just put here, 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 and go on my forehead. Yeah, I'm so mad I forgot my freaking tripod. I'm gonna go ahead and bend it down like this. This is so funny. Yeah. And you see how like my face just got so hydrated, so moisturized. And when I wake up in the morning, my skin is just as glowy as it is right now. So yes, I love it. My nighttime skincare routine is really simple because I only really put two things on my skin, which is the tretinoin and then the moisturizer, but my morning skincare routine is like a lot more steps. I do switch off, like one day I will use the tretinoin with the uracine, and then the next day I'll exfoliate, and I use the Polish Choice with the uracine. So like I do every other day, like I switch back and forth. But like my morning is like this, 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 this. It's like a lot of stuff in the morning. <coughs> Like, and I gotta use these facial pads to clean. I use these to clean my face in the morning. I totally forgot I had these in here. But yeah, I use these pads. Like, you wet it, it sponges up big. After I do my face, I do moisturize my body with this EOS. I love this. This is the most hydrating body lotion, and it's not sticky. <laughs> okay. This is the best lotion. It leaves you hydrated, and it gives you a shine. It's not sticky. And it smells good. And it's just so off. Like, it just, oh, I don't know. It just does something to me. It makes, oh, yeah, I told you I'm getting low. Now it's time for me to put on my pajamas. And I can't forget my deodorant. I use Swab. 
and this is the last stuff that I've been doing lately. I've been using under eye patches because my eyes get like really puffy. If I don't know if y'all can see, especially this one, see it? It's like really puffy. So I've been using the Peter Thomas Rolls. I use the detoxifying ones. I like those really well. This is gonna be my first time trying these out. These are the 24 karat pure luxury lift and firm hydro gel eye patches. Okay, let's try these out. See how they do. Finding grass now, dropping bundle. You so you so you baby baby baby. Perfect. So I just leave these on for like maybe 20, 30 minutes before I'm about to go to bed. I didn't even show you my little pajamas. I'm gonna put my robe on. And yeah, girl is ready for bed. But I'm not even going to bed right now. I'm about to go take some shots with my man. Yeah, so let's go. All right, y'all. Yeah, I'm about to make me a plate. So I'm about to eat. I got my cheeseburger and I got my hot dog and my little piece of chicken right there. I'm so hungry. Damel did his thing on the grill. This is messy. Y'all, why? She was closer to the other. Y'all are just. Oh, this is what? What are you talking about? It looks like you got Senegalese to us. A what? <laughs> You are slow. That is not what it's called. It's called Senglas. It's not for no Senglas. It's called Senegalese. It's Senegalese, though. All right. Yeah, drop in the comments if it's called Senegalese. Senegalese. What? Just stop speaking. Eat your food. Y'all, I'm about to eat this chicken. Mm. Girl, the back of your... Mm. <laughs> the top of that... Mm. The front of that. Mm. Happy birthday to you. Mushki, what are you doing? You chilling by yourself? Come on. Yeah, we just got to the diner. We going out for the twins' birthday breakfast. Why did you wear those outside? Told you what about that. Let's get this crazy. Two order. Um, Side them with order. I ordered the chicken too. Special. Mm -hmm. Yes. And you have cheese. Mm -hmm. And bacon. Thank you. And I got the chicken and waffles. And I got the sponge chicken too. Those are fabulous. They love chicken. I get the breakfast right now. Then I got one of the. It's like twelve, so it's kind of like brunch. Trying to see if she can put it together. 
She's getting the ice right now. That's how much? That's all you need? It doesn't say, just place frozen ice cubes in here. Do not fill past max fill line. This looks like this. Place a cone under the shaver bowl to catch the shape. Look at the Okay, bet stand on that. Gotta get with Sarah. Why we didn't get no Sarah? Okay, guys, so we getting started on making the twins' birthday dinner. We having shish kebabs, fried chicken, steak, hot dogs, hamburgers, a bunch of stuff. So right now I'm just prepping the shish kebabs. We got Demi over here eating some takis. Like she's always tearing them up. Watch her iPad. My mom is over here on her phone and the twins are taking a nap. So yeah, that's what we doing. We getting everything together. We did want to take them back to the water park, but they still taking a nap. So if we're finishing time prepping the food, then we're going to take them back. If not, we'll just go tomorrow in the morning. Yeah, but we're about to have a little celebration for the babies. For their birthday. They had so much fun earlier. They are so tired. They probably wake up a little later. I really don't even know what time it is right now, but yeah, we getting the food started. Just got finished with the shish kebabs. I'm about to bring them out so Dime could put them on the grill. Baby got the food. We got to put it on the grill. Shish kebabs is going on the grill. We got the burgers going. Yeah, we about to eat so good tonight. I want to add cheese on mine though. The view is so nice. Let me show y'all. So glad I was able to do this for my babies. Melly just woke up from my nap. Hey, mama. Come on, mama. Just woke up from that nap. You enjoying your birthday? Your hair's a mess. Cake is on the ground. Burgers. That's they look good. And I seasoned it so good, too. Yeah, Demi just went over there to go play some games. They have like a whole sitting area. It's so nice over there. She gonna go sit over there. She crazy. She got her iPad. She got her drink. She got her phone. She got Wi-Fi. She chilling. Okay, guys, the food is all done. We got hot dogs. We got hamburgers. You can add your own cheese. We got grilled chicken, shish kebabs, some steak. We got fried chicken, and we got salad, rice. And big beans. Pretty princess. Ah. Ah. Melly. So it is time to say happy birthday now, and it's so chaotic because Mella don't want to come. Stand next to Melly and say happy birthday. She's literally in the corner on the iPad, not paying us and no mind. And then when she did come over there, she was crying. So we over her. She wasn't trying to hear nothing we were saying. But overall, the girls enjoyed their birthday. Melly tearing that cake up. And then yeah, we got Mella. She don't want to participate in her birthday. Mushki. Mushki. So yeah, that's how their birthday went. These are the little bit of pictures that I was able to get in my mom. They look so super cute and they had so much fun. Hey y'all, we are about to check out our villa and I realized I never gave y'all a freaking villa tour. So this is a lived in villa tour. I just wanna show y'all just in case anybody wanna come book. First thing I'm gonna show y'all is the living room and the kitchen. When you come through that door, you will come in this way. This is the living room seating area. This is like a little dining table slash kitchen area. This is so much space. This villa do sleep eight to 10 people. So you'll be able to, you know, bring your family and friends and you have a time. This is the kitchen area. Nice, big, spacious. Love it with the LED lights. Nice refrigerator. The ice machine has ice. The next thing I'm going to show y'all is the patio. Sorry for this being so chaotic, but I just feel like I had to show y'all this. Oh, and they have like these little nook areas right here. And over there where like people could sleep they have little seating chairs for the kids this little stool they have this table too that goes over here but we moved it for the girls little birthday celebration yesterday two doors you can go out of this is a sliding door this door you need the key which is your wristband that you need to get in if you don't have a wristband you can't get in this is the patio nice big patio Comes with the grill. The grill is included in your stay. Yeah, these are the vibes. So it has the couch, seating area right here. So it has the fire pit. This is the views of the villa. 
the me and the mace s'mores but i didn't get no videos so mad i was just enjoying the time so yeah back in let me run through real quick because we ready to go this is the bathroom leave out of here the kids room tv has led lights through the wall bunk bed for the kids these mattresses are super soft and two little bean bags right here those are so comfortable this is another room where demi and my mom slept well demi didn't sleep in here my mom slept in here two beds tv the closet has slippers and they come with ropes then over here is where me and Damel and the baby slept um we have king size bed tv closet robes and slippers and then this is our bathroom shower is really nice the toilet is separate and this is the sink big deep sink we loved our villa it was so nice we can't wait to come stay again we about to head out and head home so yeah i'll see y'all when i get home